Dara. Lewis. Guess what day it is. It's a bargain bin Wednesday? Bargain bin Wednesday. What? Why what a we... strange time to Why? do a bargain Why bin. Why would we do that? Maybe it's because for the entire month of October, we'll be doing what we call a Spooktober. Spooktoberfest. Spooktober. Spooktoberfest. Spooktoberfest. <laughs> One of those. Um, so for every weekday. weekday, because COVID hit us and we couldn't record as much, for every weekday of October, we will be posting a horror game uh, of random choosing, mostly. Yes. Uh, so, you know, there's going to be some stinkers in there, but there's going to be some not stinkers, too. Oh, there's going to be some spooky moments. Ooh, there's going to be some stinkers, oh, though. Oh, man, there's <laughs> going to be some big old stinkers. But for now, for today on this Bargain Bin Wednesday... Yeah. Uh, we, we are playing Going, going Under. Under. We're playing Going, going Under. <laughs> go ahead. I'm sorry. We're playing... Going Under! There we go. <laughs> uh, it is... I want to guess the genre... Is it a roguelike? Yeah, roguelite, but yeah. Light? Yeah. Wait, that's a thing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it is. <laughs> um, okay. Uh, so far, I love the animation. It looks super fun. Ignore that file. Okay, cool. Um, is this about the stock market? No. Really? Because that... Welcome to the beautiful city it's of It's not Neo about profits? Oh, look, they're, they're explaining nice it. Monorail ride? Okay. We at Cubicle would like to congratulate you on joining the ranks of over 100,000 employees hired through the Impoverished huh. Intern Initiative. Well, this, uh... As the largest e-commerce corporation in the nation hmm. state, we're e proud to support huh? the next generation of innovators. Sounds like it a... It might be hard to believe, profits. but Cubicle started out as nothing more than a great idea from someone just like you. Hmm. Like so many Neo Cascadian success stories, Cubicle Why do began I want to find a startup, skip button on just this a ad. couple guys in a garage with nothing but a dream no. and a <laughs> That's why we're paying it I'll forward. skip the other dialogue. Since this the has voice to our it, company, so. we have okay, acquired countless startups and provided startups. them with funding and hard workers to help accelerate their success. Our friendly integrated AI has assigned you as a marketing assistant at our latest member of the family, Fizzle Beverages. By inventing a sparkling water that's also a meal replacement, Fizzle cleverly disrupted two industries at once. There's no better place for an intern to grow than somewhere like Fizzle, where you'll never be the smartest person in the room. <laughs> when you're not hard at work with Fizzle, you'll have plenty of time to experience some of the rich Pacific Northwestern culture our great city has to offer. Ooh. Now. Let's go over some ground rules for your internship. Is this a paid internship? First of all, never under any circumstances I didn't hear that explore beneath it's not. the Oh. Mm, that's weird, buddy. <laughs> Notice I had to watch the same video when I applied online. And you know, some stuff. We're skipping it. We're going through it. What? So so here's one of the basic plots of it. We're in this giant uh, cubicle building, right? Okay. Where various startups happen, and as they uh, tank, uh, instead of you know them emptying the office and uh, getting on with their lives, instead it sinks to below the ground, and all of them become monsters. <laughs> so if the business does bad, they become monsters. Yeah. And several businesses are gonna go bad. We're we're going to explore a, a few of those businesses that went bad. Oh no. But first, we gotta go get to that monster and kill it using office supplies. <laughs> Great! Oh my gosh, I can appreciate this game so much. Working at an office, I I can say I've never experienced the need to kill a monster, but I can say there are several implements in most offices that you can use for destruction. Computer screens, uh, hole punchers, the big freaking heavy ones. Oh buddy, we got computer screens, we got keyboards, we got staplers. Oh, staplers are always good and very common. And if you work at a specific type of company, you might have those giant calculators. Those are heavy. Oh, and there's calculators in this too. Yeah. yeah. Now, the first uh, business that went under, that we're going into, is Joblin. Are there going to be goblins in Joblin? No, there's going to be Joblins. Oh, goodness gracious. <laughs> I guess that makes more sense. All right, let's just go through all this. Oh, that's right. <laughs> that's funny. I think I think they might be a bunch of accountants. I'm not entirely sure. You know, you got weapons like uh, like pencils. 
Nice, nice, Laptops nice. Uh -huh, uh -huh. and bone clubs. Uh -huh. You know, your typical office supplies. Oh yeah, I, I see that at my office all the time. Sometimes you need a bone club to, you know, get some stuff done. It's yeah. very appropriate. You got your, your ping pong paddles? I don't have a ping pong table in my office. It's kind, that's kind of disappointing. I wish we would fix that. You got your giant coffee pots? Oh yes, we have giant coffee pots. And sometimes they do become broken. You just slap you just slap the goblins around with the office supplies. You go in here, you get power-ups. I don't know which one I want, so I'm just going to take this one that hurts things when I get hurt. Nice. Also, as a specific office worker, I, I'm appreciating the little things here and there. Like, there's... Anytime there's a good dialogue or um, something that you find that's helpful, there's a an upwards green arrow, which represents, you know, increased profits. Like ping pong, sword. Yeah. So anytime something's broken, it's a yellow or it's an orange downward. Yeah, you know, your classic office supplies as well, like swords. Yeah. Very, very important office supply. You can never have enough swords in never, the ever. Uh, modern day office. Ooh, spears. Can't remember the last time we had a good spear in the office. <laughs> there's a there's a dick joke somewhere in there. Oh my goodness. <laughs> yeah, staples. Staples are very important at office work. It's true. I've used many in my uh, times in an office. Yes, and, and it is a, a not so common knowledge that you heat up giant coffee pots for the whole office by a bonfire. Yep. That's the, the only way to make really good coffee. If you don't have a bonfire in your office kitchen, you are failing at life. Yeah, what are you even doing with your life if you don't have that? Exactly. Just, uh, get this keyboard here. Keyboards are important. Oh no. Regarding the unacceptable long bathroom breaks taken by contractors, from now on, all toilet seats will be angled at 45 degrees to encourage... I smell something. <laughs> I smell... A productivity blocker. Oh my god, I love this. I love this <laughs> game so much. Hey, you're the boss around here. Uh, I got sent down here to let you know uh, you guys really aren't supposed to be. We have no time for holdups. Not at this stage of the job. Eliminate this blocker, contractors, and then we will res resume our daily sync up. Oh my god. Do not try to sneak away to the bathroom after the battle, or I will know. <laughs> it's true. You gotta watch out for those extended bathroom breaks. Time is money. Yeah. Yeah. I wonder if I, can, if I can even win this fight. Have you not been able to? I did not when I first played it, no. Well, keep trying. Oh, oh, you know what? You, you might... I might not. Oh, oh. I really want you to win this battle. I need oh, me to too. Win. I'm so close to it now. Oh, watch out. Oh! Oh, don't get cocky. Don't get greedy. Yes! Oh my goodness, you did! Oh! Ah, you oh, dick! Oh, <laughs> that's so not fair! Fizzle! Developing flexibility! That's so funny. Thank you everyone for joining me for our daily uh, stand-up. And, you know, this is just some stuff. It's just some story stuff. <laughs> oh, goodness. I'm, I'm not I'm not gonna go through all this actually I can't I have to I have to just click through it we're gonna if you want to read the dialogue specific viewer that complained about this yeah you, you can, can just pause it at pause specific it. times yeah so do that it's not letting me skip as fast oh goodness <coughs> excuse me God bless you see now I have a specific goal I gotta reach the bottom of Joblin and defeat the boss. Which I should just be able to do now, because I'm good at the game. You yeah. know? I've I've played games before and I got real good at them. Oh yeah. Now I have to make a comment. I I work in a normal human office that um doesn't have toys everywhere. Oh, then you must not be working in California. I'm not working in California. I'm working in a different state that will not be specified. But um I just think it's funny that all some of these, you know, big specific companies are like, let's make, and I get it, you know, I don't, I don't know the, anyway, I, I just think there's nothing wrong with having a, a calm work environment that doesn't involve bright colors everywhere and toys and slides and beanbag chairs everywhere. I all mean, businesses need bright colors and oh slides everywhere. No, you, you need, I mean, anyway. 
That's how businesses work, love. Well, I'm well, I'm biased. I, I appreciate my normal human office. Every business I've worked for has had bright colors and obvious shapes to them. Um, and, uh, and, and fun, like, slide-like things. It's true. Uh, and I also work with, with a bunch of babies. You do work with I, a bunch I of work babies. with babies. It's true. And that's an explanation for that. <laughs> <laughs> that's fair. Your office is very different than mine. Yeah. But anyway, we're not talking about my boring, super fun office. We're talking about the modern-day office where you absolutely need weapons. You don't live in a modern-day office? Oh, you don't live. You don't work at a modern-day office? I don't live in my office. I don't have a cot and a bedpan that we use sometimes. Bedpan, huh? Nope, I didn't say that. We have a bathroom. We are allowed to use our bathrooms. I don't believe you. <laughs> you probably shouldn't. I feel like I should, though. Yeah! Water cooler! Where? Right there. Uh. I think it's well, anything I can grab. No, but it's very fun. Every office has a water cooler. Uh, this is the Joblin Cafe. Nice, you nice. You can buy things here, like a, 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 job, witch. a job witch. And Joblin, Joblin Spice, Spice Latte. latte. And uh, this perk. Re Retaliate. And a spiked club. Ooh, nice. They just sell those, you know. Of course, of course. Most and offices do. Of course, of course. I'm just gonna get that. It's actually a decent weapon. Very cool. How are you getting money? Oh, I'm stealing it from the Joblins. Oh, this seems really mean. As I, I beat mean, the like... crap out of them, I take their money. So, what was the... I'm speaking from a... my job perspective. What was their business, and why did it fail? I don't know. It moment... looks like they're a bunch of number crunchers, though. I mean, maybe. Got little cubicle setups there. Very nice. I appreciate that. Uh, giant, giant. Okay, now we're starting to look more like Breath of the Wild in some of the setups. Giant oversized uh, meat. Oh, that looks. Actually, it looks. Are you eating it? I, I, I ate it, yeah. I instantly ate it. That's cool. There's other stuff I have to get. There's That's a reference in here that I really love. In here? This is somewhere in this dungeon, yes. I'll do that another time. Thumbtack! Perks! Boiky boiks. Now I can punch things with better power. Very cool. That's very important. It's Being able to punch is very important in the, in the office environment. Not just in the office, but in the streets too, kids. Every uh, Kids, if anyone tells you punching is not a life skill you'll need, they're lying because they intend to punch you in the future. This is true. So don't listen to people who tell you not to punch. Oh man, I hate it when crazy rock people show up in the rock vampires. They're rock vampires. Oh, he's a he's a joblin. Okay, rock joblin. He's a rock joblin. Rock joblin. Okay, I'm pretty sure I'll find it on this floor. Gee. Refilling thermos, styling up pompadours. I can't read. I'm tired. It's um, okay. We all are. Joblin LLC. It's an LLC. Yeah. <laughs> That's. Funny. Oh. I wonder if they made an S selection. One can only hope. It would have been much better for them if they did, but, uh, especially with, you know, they, they seem to have a pretty large setup, so an S election would have been very helpful for them. Actually, they probably should have just incorporated, because, I mean, this is, I mean, it, it, this is a whole, whole level. Cubicle this is has your back. all the same business that we're fighting against. Uh, I, uh, wait, what? Because we're, this is, we're still fighting against Joblins. Yeah. Yeah. Is it, is Joblins just the common name for what we're fighting? Or is this a specific? Uh, they, they, I'm pretty sure they just call them goblins, actually, now that I think about it. Oh, okay. But the name of the business it's Joblin. is Joblin. And there's, but there's more than one business that we're going to encounter yeah. in the game. Oh, okay, okay. That's what I want to make sure. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Mm. I forget the name of the second one that we go to, but the third one is called Winky Dinks. Oh, no. It is a, it is a dating app. Oh, no. <laughs> You're basically fighting a bunch of succubi and stuff. Yeah, that was uh, doomed to fail. Yeah. I just, I really do appreciate the uh, just the office environment. It's a know. it's a dating app based entirely around communicating via emojis. That's so funny. Everybody loves a good dry erase board. I'm out of, I'm out of guitar. 
amount of guitar juice what and is... start beating people. I'm trying to read what that says. Joblin something, master or none? Joblin of all trades, master of none. <laughs> it says that on just about oh, everyone, yeah. doesn't it? Okay, well, not this one. That one says work, 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 work. Mm, and there's and a puppy missing an ear with a That's question mark? That's just a mark? giant J. Oh, goodness. For Jablin. Oh, oh, here we go. Hey, you remember Ty Lopez, right? Uh... Okay, well. Well, well, I see you made it to my humble garage. Oh, yes. Oh, my God, yes. <laughs> uh, just a moment, someone so I can get out of here. Ah, a restless one you are. Spending your cash is all well and good. But do you know what's better than items? Knowledge. Knowledge. <laughs> In fact, I'm far more proud of my vast collection of literature than I could ever be of my wares. Or my sweet car. Lamborghini. But you do sell stuff, right? In a sense. But the price may be harsher than currency. It's, it's just curses. You that's, get curses and then you get stuff. That's so funny. Um, I don't know what this does. Let's find out. So you're just going from office to office murdering everybody? Yeah. These, these poor monsters. So were they normal people before their business failed? Yes. So that's an, an unknown consequence of your business failing. All of your workers, including yourself, will turn into horrible monsters and if, you'll be murdered. If you were if you were bought out by cubicle and your business fails. Okay. Oh. Oh goodness. That's a that's a some pretty fine print there. Yeah. Uh, always read the fine print. Never, Never sign. read the fine print, kids. No, don't don't sign anything without reading it. Otherwise you will become a, a joblin. A goblin monster if your business fails. You mean you'll become sexy? They're not that sexy. Jacqueline. 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 I could go all the way. Will you, though? I mean, I might. That's I'm you. not having a bad run. No, well, you're doing good. I'm not gonna lie, it would be pretty fun to, uh. Well, no, not with the. Not with the suits we wear. The, I was gonna say that I wouldn't mind having a slide to transport myself between the locations in the office, but with the, uh, the suits that we wear and the business attire, it wouldn't be as comfortable. Okay, so I'm not allowed to not move. Or, well, I wasn't allowed to not move. You had to keep moving? Or... I had to keep moving or I'd get let on fire. Don't get let on fire. Oh, I, I, I won't now. Good. I need, I need weapons. Oh, goodness. There's a sword. Yeah, it's in my hands. Oh, okay. There's so many everywhere. You sound so mad. They're a little mad. It sounds like they have the dying noise of monsters in uh in Breath of the Wild. No, it was that it was that gun boots uh game where you had the gun boots. Gun boots. I can't remember the name of it. Gunchen. Downwell. Down. Oh. Is that the one with the cat? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that was a fun game. I did a. I beat this and so can you on it. Mm -hmm. Which I need to do more of, I guess, but I don't yeah. have enough very short games for it. No, no, no. Mmm, <laughs> exploding barrels. Those are, uh, I, mean, I assume that's gonna explode. Or maybe it's just poisonous. I oh, but it did explode! Yeah. Why would a barrel be poisonous? I don't know. Poisonous things exist. <gasps> Driving a car oh, in the I office. I can't go through the door. That well. doesn't seem like it's kosher to company policy. Nah, it's fine. Especially mm. like cornering someone and just beating them to death. I think somebody needs to read the employee manual. And bashing people over the head with uh, with benches and throwing <laughs> bones at them. Throw me a bone, come on, guys. It's terrible, I hate you. <laughs> oh, crossbow! Oh, Heck my phone's yeah. ringing. How can I possibly stop that from here? Uh, <laughs> mysterious cut. Shut up, phone. <laughs> Damn it. I'm sorry, sir. I can't talk right now. No. Anyway, where was I? Uh, mysterious cut. Um. I might just leave that in. Who knows? Base of an Aiden. Uh, yeah, but there's like so many Sarahs. That's true. <laughs> Save me, stapler! Take that! Staple guns are fun. It's not a staple, it's a staple gun, though. It's just a regular staple. Yeah, but you're turning it into a gun by projectiling the staples from it, like a gun. I see. Okay, yeah. got you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he sounded so sad. Exploding boxes! Why? 
I, I don't think it's uh, kosher for company policy to have uh, exploding boxes. Swords kosher, are huh? fine. Swords, uh, crossbows, guitars, ex all fine. Explosives, I'm not okay with. I, 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 I disagree with explosives in the office. I think that's going a little too far. It's just a smidgen. But you know, it, it's cubicle. They're a bit of one of those wacky, advanced, uh, very progressive company, so you know. Cornering people and playing your guitar at, in their face to death can't possibly be not sexual harassment. No, of course not. You know, I, I know these guys are monsters and they, 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 they're they out there, they're losing their jobs and their lives. So, you know, I, I feel kind of bad for them. I don't. Also, that's a very sad bathroom. There was no sink. Yeah. It's gross. It's fine. It's terrible working oh, conditions. it's fine. In fact, I haven't seen very many bathrooms. It's uh, very upsetting. That's the reason these businesses went under. It's because you kept forcing the employees to poop in their seats. What do you mean I kept to doing that? I don't run these businesses. No, but you want to. No, I don't. Oh, I, I see that, that aspiration in her eyes. She wants to become, like, the big CEO, top dog person. They're on to me. Oh, how, what do you mean? Hmm? What? what? I knew it. This guy's just doing his thing. Jelly. Hmm, I don't need that. Huh? Nope. Now, since, uh, like, some, uh, rogue, roguelike games in this fashion, they don't have a teleport, uh, button like, like some of them do, so I need Where to walk all the way back to where I need to go. Oh my gosh. And that's gonna take- no, So I'm much here, time. actually. Oh, good. Cause that was gonna take forever. Oh, goodness. Oh, oh, the poor janitor. He's just, he's just doing his thing. If this thing no. doesn't involve dying, then I don't yeah. care. You know, maybe they're not monsters. Maybe they're just really ornery because their company failed and they're losing their livelihood. I mean, they could be. They probably should be, you know, acting a little differently. Liberty for Jacqueline. But yeah. It's still sad. Explosives! So now when I dodge roll, bombs. Cool. Just don't uh, get hit by your own bomb. Why? Because it'll be very painful. Seems like a good thing to do, though. It's true. It's fun to surround yourself with explosives and slowly set them off one at a time. All right, I'm going to beat this first place in one go. Okay. <laughs> I, didn't, I just caught that she says we. That's so funny. You said we with her once, though. Did I? Yeah. Whoops. I guess that was an accident. Goodness, I did not remember that. That's okay, though. What is our character's name? Jacqueline. Jacqueline. That sounds like an office name. <laughs> That's so funny. He's uh, he's the caffeine, Activity. and notice that he's Bane. <laughs> oh my gosh, he is! That's hilarious! Oh my god, I I love this game. This is so much fun. No, it's a very it's uh, what's the word I'm looking for? It's so wacky and silly. Yo, man, whoever whoever made the game, and I should probably look at who the devs are before I start doing this stuff. Yeah. Like I say, I should do every time. Uh, a lot of heart in this game. Oh yeah, absolutely. It's so creative and all the little details in it to parody an office. I, I absolutely appreciate it. I think it's so funny. And I mean, the gameplay looks like it's actually kind of fun. Yeah. Like, I think I would have fun with this. I mean, I'm not gonna. <laughs> I'm bad at video games, but... Aren't we all? No, not you. Oh my goodness. He just broke his face. Well, not yet, but you're getting there. Uh. Oh, oh, what is, he, he birthed a person. Oh. No, no, there's, there's a dude there. Oh. They're carrying a Cap soda cans on them, oh, so he shakes them up and throws them like a bomb. Oh, that's so funny. <laughs> See, I would have expected him to, like, pop them open and drink it to get more caffeine. No, he's got the caffeine thing on his back. Oh, that's true. He's injecting it Bane style. <laughs> it's probably not healthy. I definitely don't think you should be injecting caffeine directly into your veins. Nah, it's fine. Oh, goodness. He reminds me of a fight with Volgan in Metal Gear Solid 3. I can see that. Yeah. Ooh. Gurr, small-minded, uncaffeinated human intern. This setback will not stop us. We will eliminate all blockers and complete the job. And after this job, another. And another. A joblin's work is never done. Do not think that you can derail us with your naivety and lack of hustle. Enjoy your victory, human. Or, human intern. It will be your last. Oh, Boss dismissed instead <laughs> of, like, destroyed. That's funny. 
The mana press and it looks to prevent exhaustion, permanently <laughs> increase your max health. Nice. We did That's it. Cool. Yeah. All right, let's go back to the home base. Internet evaluation. 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 I'm tired. It says evaluation, love. Yep, successfully completed the dungeon. Yeah. Nice. So as you uh, beat dungeons with whatever skills you find out through there, and you know you, yeah, that progress bar will fill up uh, as you use them, and then you can start out with them. That's cool. Really well with one of them. That's cool. Well, this is uh, a. <coughs> what's the name of the game again? Going under. Going under, because businesses are going under. It is very sad. Yeah. Well, that was going under, guys. Yeah, that was. I'm gonna skip through this because you know it's story stuff. You don't want to. You don't want to be spoiled. No. Don't no, worry. Don't so. worry about giving that over to that guy. Oh, how it's much is this game? Twenty. Twenty. I think. Oh, I hope it's twenty. If not. Oh, I hope I didn't put another twenty-five dollar game oh, on here. Oh goodness. If if it is, ooh, what a bargain. And if it's twenty-five, whoopsie. Uh, let's just let's say it's twenty, but I'm gonna flash the price 20. now. And hopefully, there. hopefully that says twenty and not twenty-five. Or, well, 1999 well, and not yeah. 25. Oh, you know what I mean. Yeah, we'll see what happens. All right, well, that's, uh, that's, this, that's... Thank you for watching. Yep. Oh, and don't forget to check out every weekday in October. Spooktober! It's, Spooktober it's Fest. It's Spooktober, uh, everyone. Enjoy Halloween for the whole month with yeah. us. Enjoy us freaking while out. While we play spooky and, games and, and scream at some of them. Yeah, only some of them. Some Did of you them... know that old horror games get more of a jump out of me than new ones? Yeah, it's kind of funny. Amazing, right? Wait, anyway. wait till you hear us. Both of us scream like little girls. Good night, everyone. Bye.